When today becomes tomorrow and my hair is turned to snow, will you walk beside me through the valley as I go? When today becomes tomorrow and my hair is turned to snow, will you walk beside me through the valley as I go? Thanks for our city. Today, that begins with San Francisco police combing the city for four armed men who stormed a small cafe and then opened fire last night. I feel like the Gary South is live in the Mission District and joins us now with all the details. Gary. The Mexico Lindo Cafe. It's not even a cafe, really, it's a bar right next to the George Moscone Elementary School here on Folsom Street. And for all of this, happened. We say shortly before 10 last night, the bar was invaded by four robbers, each armed with either a revolver or a semi-automatic weapon. That ruined at least one day of my life. Or gives great hope to be familiar in America. Me, I have the chance.
says that he is the first U.S. president with the guts in his words to tackle this explosive issue. And he thinks that the don't ask, don't tell policy is the best that he can do at the moment. With the gut to tackle this explosive issue. Don't ask, don't tell policy. With the gut to tackle this explosive issue. So let's go ahead and take you here into Rifle, Colorado, where the rains were rifling down. And uh, apparently uh, folks had big problems there with flooding, as you can see here, streets. And uh, this town of Rifle, folks had to be evacuated yesterday as the waters rose. Today, the area is drying out.
salsa is a fish taco shaped like a fish? What have they been through that makes them so terrified of relationships that people that they just don't want nothing to do with them? It's sad. It's so 
I wasn't scared of you when I saw you. But you're one in a million, you know? You're actually sitting down and talking to me. people don't it's just sad because there's so much beautiful things in life there's so many beautiful things in life relationships are beautiful nobody wants relationships check the
the way we talk in Tucson, Arizona.